Welcome to the EMG module. In this video, you will learn about the software setup. To begin, open EMG Works Acquisition from the desktop. Click Close on the About pop-up. To begin, you will create a test configuration file that contains the details of your project. First, locate the folder of your class and double-click to enter it. Click New to create a new project file. Rename the test configuration file based on the date and activity. For this example, we named it 8 under 19 bicep curls. Double click on your file to enter it. You will be working your way down the tree of options on the left hand side of the screen. Start at People. Add a new entry for the test subject, or select a previous subject from the drop-down list. Enter name, display name, weight, height, and gender. Repeat this process for the test operator. The only necessary information for the operator is name. Next, click on Hardware. Visually verify that the Trigno wireless system is selected as the A-D device. You should also check the physical Trigno base unit to make sure everything is connected properly. The EMG lights should be on. They will display a solid green light when fully charged. Next, click on Sensors. There are 16 total sensors listed in numerical order. It is recommended to only activate the number of sensors that you will be using in your project. Right-click on Avanti Sensor 1 and select Remove All Sensors. Click OK in the dialog box. Click on the Avanti symbol under Avanti Sensor Types to add the correct number of sensors you will be using. You can right-click again on a sensor to remove it individually if needed. Left-click on Avanti Sensor 1 to bring up the Options menu for the sensor. Rename the sensor based on the location you will be placing it. Be sure to still include the number of sensors in the name to help keep track of which sensor you will be placing on what muscle. Example, 1. Right Biceps Brachii If you do not need the accelerometer or IMU data, it is recommended to set the configuration type to EMG only. This increases the rate or frequency of data collection, which results in higher quality data. Click on EMG only and then apply configuration mode to all. Next, click on experiment workflow on the left side tree. The top row of boxes make up your library of workflow templates. You will manually click and drag these templates to lower sections to design a workflow for your experiment. You can hover over each of these templates to get a better understanding of its details. But Signal Preview and Plot and Store are the templates you will use most often. Now, click and drag to pull them down into Workflow Design. To remove any unwanted templates, click and drag them off the screen and they will disappear. The Signal Preview shows a real-time data feed of sensor activity without saving any of the data. This allows for verification that sensors are placed in the correct spot on the body and are working properly. Change the name based on the sensor you will be checking. Select Sensor for Feedback. Template Descriptions. The signal preview shows a real-time data feed of sensor activity without saving any of the data. This allows for a verification that sensors are placed in the correct spot on the body and are working properly. Change the name based on the sensor you will be checking. Select Sensor for Feedback. Plot and Store shows records of data for specified periods of time. Name of activity, example, biceps concentration curls. Enter test, runtime, for a minute. Select sensors that will be active, examples, 1 and 2. Under General Settings, the number of trials of data you would like to collect. Once the experiment workflow is completed, click on Start Test in the bottom right-hand corner. Rename this Test Run. Use the subject initials, name of activity, and test run number. 
Make sure the correct subject and operator are selected. Make sure the correct target folder is selected. Locate the data folder for your class. Click OK. Now click OK on the Test Run Name dialog box. In this example, we are starting with the first activity, which is the right biceps check. In the sensor activation procedure, there will be pop-ups showing which sensors are needed. First, remove the sensor from the base station. While the sensor is glowing white, hold the sensor against the dark green circle on the white tag in the middle of the base station, with the arrow pointing downwards. The sensor will become green, then continuously blink. This sensor is now ready for data collection.